idea if you guys can like properly see me but i'm gonna try and do like a fit check um yeah so this jacket is from Foschini. um it's not mine it's from Foschini. this t-shirt is from jet a million years ago these are from Foschini or true it's i always forget i'm not sure and then these are puma and my socks are mr price sport i hope you guys can see me and that's the outfit i need to put on some earrings i don't have any makeup on just have like some blush you know looking cute so excited i haven't had my nails done in 10 months like yeah this little um what is it called maintenance week is long overdue so yeah let's get to that okay can y'all see me? Y'all cannot see me. Let me knock my phone down. Okay, so I'm packing my tripod. This is the bag that I'm bringing. This tote bag from Mr. Price. Um, I already have some of the things that are always in my bag. In here, I have my sanitizer, my sunnies, my purse and my lip therapy and then the extras that i'm packing are sunscreen because um uv lights and whatever tiktok make me go okay <laughs> earphones these are more so for like the bolts going there i'm not really for um my appointment and then tripod this cute little sleek tripod that i just got because content house keys and that's really all i'm packing essentially you know cute little totes and Catch you guys when I get in the house, when I get home, and I can eat. Period. Guys, we're going out. Like, could you ever? Could you ever? Could you ever? Oh, so sorry. This is what I'm wearing. I changed midday because my outfit was giving Eskimo and Guyashi San. Guyashi San. See? Oh, I love to cuisine. La Pugo, now we're telling you, Dan. I'm seven, though. I'm so tired. 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 I'm so
Yes. Oh. tripod. I see Dodge. You can't even see my outfit properly because I was trying on his skirt, but it doesn't go up. <laughs> then I'm changing this. Wow. Gonna try again. It's in room you're clean. I'm clean. It's like the last step of maintenance, you know. So first, this is the oil that I use. It's the oil that I use to moisturize my face all the time and stuff. I don't know why my accent just switched up just like that. 
this from Porsche M and then this mini razor you can really get this razor at I can think clicks this came Scarlet Hill has them it looks like this I'm, I just want to see if it's focusing I'm just doing like a little bit more pampering with my skin tonight because that's gonna guys I don't think also disclaimer double planning is not like recommended to do at home you like nobody recommends that you diy your demo planning because but because in sunday's indoor and budget is low i'm doing it myself i trust myself more than i trust anybody else to do this so rather manga being a see and miss you right just like all over can you see me nail mm -hmm. just want to listen right and then i'm looking that way i'm not ignoring you guys okay just so that this is the closest mirror and i want to see properly okay this is the oh it's the end of like maintenance week i don't really do a lot of maintenance this is really what i do like my hair my nails i usually do my hair myself and this i'm getting a so in because I usually just get my locks or get braids. But I really wanted something cute this time, so that's why I opted on outsourcing my hair. My hair person uh, outsourcing a braid out. And she killed it, okay? Like, she did the damn thing. I'm so happy with that. I'm happy with my nails. They're so good. Like, I think I just have a mustache and I need to make peace with the fact that I have a mustache. Because whenever you do makeup, I can see like the fuzz on my face. I hate how like the end of the razor, like this part, is always so sharp, like bro. There's barely anything in my face, bro. I'm gonna show you guys at the end because this is disgusting. This is nasty, okay? Also, I think it would only be appropriate if I preface, preface, if I disclaimer, okay, that I don't think having hair in your face is disgusting or anything. I don't think that there's genuinely any need to remove the hair on your face. It's not disturbing. If anything, it's protecting your face, I think. I don't remember properly okay I, I don't think i paid that much attention in class but if anything it's protecting your skin from like dust and stuff so i don't think you need to remove it from your face but i'm personally doing it because it makes my makeup application better it makes my makeup look better so that's why i'm doing it uh, other than that really mm, i don't care i never cared until i knew that i could do that i mean i always cared 
because like I always saw that like my makeup like you see like the fuzz on my face when I make up on but like it wasn't that big of a deal because I thought okay everybody has it until I saw the TikTok girlies during my planning and I was like oh period and then Sunday's in guys like so initially that's what I have without like wiping whatever's left on my face off that's what we have and I'm just gonna wipe it off with this piece of tissue you don't judge me okay I don't know if it looks like hygienic or anything okay Ew. white white i don't know if you guys can tell my skin definitely looks like more red than it is especially like in these areas like right here yeah that happens now when i say toner i meant lemon juice okay lemon juice a little cotton pad what i do i think toners are they serve the same purpose as this it's been working for me i've been doing this for about a year yeah yeah i cut myself i cut myself so it's either I use lemon juice or use apple cider vinegar whenever i tone my face i cut myself so bad yeah so yeah, whenever you hear me talk about toner, guys, I cut myself everywhere. Like, I haven't done this in so long. I forgot. I, I have so many cuts. Like, it's not enough. So, if you hear me talk about toner, whenever I'm literally talking about either apple cider vinegar or lemon juice, it's out of this world. I still do recommend getting like a real toner um I don't know I've used what toners have I used I've used the Porsche M toner and I've used Isabella Garcia those I was supposed to scrub my face I wanted to scrub to just scrub but that's fine I'll just scrub my face tomorrow morning so you guys are gonna see that in the next vlog but yeah, those are the two toners that I've used besides my homemade toners, I guess. So I, I know this is probably, again, I'm not a skincare girl, so I don't know what what's what. But again, marula oil and then Vaseline on top of that, just to kind of like, firstly, to moisturize and then secondly, to heal the, the skin because that's a traumatic experience for your skin so it needs some healing whether you cut it or not whether you actually like cut through your skin or not it needs healing after that so these two a good tissue oil is always a good tissue or skin oil whatever is always good and vaseline is just good for everything okay so and slugging as well which locks in whatever moisture you have in your skin so Every night, if I wash my face at night, which sometimes I do forget, but whenever I do my night skincare routine, I slag. Always, 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 your skin will be so soft, so silky, smooth, glowing and stuff. Everybody asking you where you got your skin from and stuff. Yeah, it's fascinating. That's my secret. That's what my skin looks like. Good night, you guys. Love you guys so much. I hope that you subscribed. If you were not already subscribed, like this video. Give me a comment down there. Send me some love. And yeah. Yeah. I really don't have anything else to say. I'm about to get my tea, go to sleep right now. Tomorrow is Sunday. It's church. So love you guys so, so much. No, no, no.